And if it does stretch out, you just pull it a little bit more and it'll hold quite well. Hello, welcome to Waypoint Survival. Today, I wanna to show you a ridgeline hack that no one knows. Stay tuned. I got the genesis for this idea from CBYS Paracord, and I'll make sure and put a link in the description box below as well. Now, this is not his idea, but rather watching the video, it gave me an idea, and so I have modified it to my own. I've not seen anyone else do this, and so I thought it would be neat enough to show you, and uh, let's get to that right now. The first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna take this carabiner and run the paracord through, just like this. And then we're going to go around once and twice. It's a type of noose knot. And then back through this first loop right here, like that. And then we pull it together, just like so. And that gives us a nice knot that will hold quite well on this end of the paracord. Now we simply take our snap link, this small carabiner, and we snap it around the tree. Of course, that's a very simple process. Most of you are familiar with this. Next, I have two stainless steel washers and 24 inches of paracord with both ends melted. What we're going to do is we're gonna take both of these and we're gonna slide them on like this so that they're both together. And then we're just simply going to tie an overhand knot in the two ends. Pull it tight and we have something that looks like this. The next thing we do is we put our loop that we just made over the cord and we make a prussic. And most of you are familiar how to make a prussic, so I'm not gonna go into a lot of detail with that, but we're just gonna make our simple prussic like so, organize it, pull it tight, and we have that now on the line. All right, there we go. Now I find it easier to do this if I put this part that runs between the two trees, I put this under my arm and kind of hold it up, makes it easier to work with. What you want to do is you want to run the tag end of your orange line through both of these stainless steel washers. You can pull that tension, pull all the extra slack out of your line. Once you get the tension pulled on this like you want it, continuing to hold it under your arm, you want to separate the two washers, just like this, and then take the tag end and put it back down through the bottom washer and pull it. Make sure you have all the slack out that you want in your line. So pull that end, make sure that's tight, and pull that down. And that will lock and hold it in place. The beauty of this system is that once you get this end adjusted, all you have to do then is pull on your knot here, on this prussic, to adjust it. And it holds quite well. You can see it's, it's got a lot of tension on it. And if it does stretch out, you just pull it a little bit more and it'll hold quite well. So this is what the system looks like when it's on a tree. You've got it tensioned quite well here. And of course, easily adjustable. And at that end, it's simply held around the tree and snapped in with the carabiner. This is James Bender for Waypoint Survival. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Also make sure and check out the links in the description box below. Down there, you'll find our waypointsurvival.com link. This is where you can sign up to take survival and bushcraft training at our facility in Southern Ohio. You'll also find our Patreon link. This is where you can donate to financially support the channel and you can support us for as little as a dollar a month. You'll also find our spring link. This is where you can buy great Waypoint Survival branded merchandise. And all the proceeds go to help us in our research to bring you great video content. And if you haven't done so already, please subscribe to the channel. We'd really appreciate it. And when you do subscribe, make sure and press that bell button so that you can stay notified of all of our upcoming videos. And we'll talk to you next time. <music>